Hey everybody, it's Sunday and so the test starts tomorrow. So I'm gonna just go over with you the, the rules of the test again. So I'm gonna share my screen and we'll take a look at where the test is located. So here's our screen. I think uh, everybody can see that, I think. Yes, great. Um, you go over here to your left and you see modules. Click on modules and there you will see test one right there under module one. That's when you wanna take it. Now, if you go back to the syllabus, uh, these were all the test dates that I had previously put out. Tomorrow's the 20th, so the test goes to the 20th through the 24th. Not all of them will go four days. This one does because it's, you know, we're starting out the semester with the Christmas holidays coming up. So I gave you about four days to take the test. The test will open around 12.01 a.m. So roughly in about nine hours uh, and will close on the 24th at 11.59 p.m. Now, you have to do the test in one sitting. Uh, it's a blend of multiple choice and true false. You've got one sitting to do the test. Uh, you've got uh, 40 minutes to do 50 questions, and I know I sound like a broken record, but I found that's plenty of time. Uh, just be prepared. And also make sure you have a solid internet connection. If your internet goes down or your computer crashes, that's on you. If the system goes down, that's on me. But uh, if your computer crashes, the best thing for you to do is to try to log on immediately again, because like I said, the clock will keep running and you can uh, take the, the test. Now, I'm not sure I'll do announcements for every test. Uh, I think I'm doing this one just because it's the first one and you can really sort of prep for that first exam, but make sure you always read the syllabus because the syllabus does have the different test dates on there. So our next test will be you know, a week from Monday, the 27th and 28th, only two days. Uh, and then test three is uh, December 30th through January 2nd. So yes, you can, you know, if you're looking for a new way to ring in the new year, what better way than taking a Texas government test? I can't think of one, can you? So uh, then test four is January 4th and 6th, and then final 7th and 8th, uh, you have two days to do that. Remember, you do get to drop at least one exam, or actually only one exam, I shouldn't say at least, you get to drop one exam. So if you miss an exam, that's the one you drop. If you do take the first four exams and you're happy with your grade, then you don't have to take the final and then the final will be dropped. Also keep in mind that although the computer system will drop a test, it will still show up in Canvas. So don't expect one of your test scores to disappear. It's just that the computer is not calculating that lowest grade into your final grade. Now, if you wanna know how that works, you can add up the four tests, uh, add them up and divide by four and you'll see that the percentage stays the same. So. We hit the stop share here. You now know where to take the test. Um, all I can tell you is good luck. Uh, be prepared, study hard, and you'll do fine. I don't think there's any surprises. I think the test is pretty easy, but then again, I wrote the test. So naturally, I'm going to think that. So uh, I'll get back to y'all again probably tomorrow, just as another reminder, but be prepared. And we'll talk again soon.